What is up guys, this is Marts here from Section Store once again and today we will be having a look at this lovely slideshow we just brought out a couple days ago. It's gonna help showcase your product and definitely add some nice touch to your score. It's gonna make it look more professional and hopefully increase your conversion rate and your sales. And I'm gonna show you in a couple easy steps how you can customize the whole thing. I did it for a software brand, I own it for a couple of friends and it's just supportable everywhere you want in the store and as I would just jump right into it the first thing I did was downloading the section store app you can get it completely for free in the Shopify app store it contains over 100 fully customizable components next thing I did is clicked on explore sections as you can see here with a bunch of different categories you can choose from but the one we will be choosing from today is the slideshow category and that is the one I used for this tutorial. Like I said already, the app itself is completely free, but the section, there is a one-time charge of $9. But that means if you bought it once, you're gonna own the section forever, no developer needed or anything. And at the end of the day, you're gonna save yourself a lot of time and probably money. So I think it's a pretty good deal. All right, last thing we have to do before you can actually start customizing and adding it to our very own store is heading back to the own area of the app where we want to be looking for the section itself it's that one and we want to add it to the theme we're using in my case it's the dawn light theme and then we can easily head back to the top of the app and open up our theme editor which i have done here already as you can see and the slideshow we used is this one i'm just going to show you real quick how you can add it in the first place just scroll all the way down click on add sections slide it's actually called bam slider so yeah that is the one you're just gonna click on it to actually add it to your theme editor and that's what i did here already i'm just gonna explain you on the one i already have in the store what i did so the first thing you can do is actually do some customizations to the main block itself like changing the section height you can make it a little bit less high and there are some fonts you could change as well, but I removed all the text for this one. But I'm going to show you how you can include that as well. And even a button, I put it on autoplay. And you can also set the auto delay, so how long you want the pictures to show actually. And all the colors are customizable as well. Also, lazy load you can include, so it's going to pre render the whole pictures. Now, I'm going to explain you how you can actually add the pictures. And you just simply click on one of the blocks. You can even set a little overlay on it so it's going to be more dark so the text can appear better and here you can include the images i've already selected a few which i thought looked nice together and like i said already you can even add some text and the link text here shop now and link it to a certain product or whatever you prefer actually but I do think it looked quite nice here without the text and anything and just let the pictures tell the story and add some nice design to the rest of the store. All right, with that being said, I say we just save it all up, just did like a little adjustment where I made it less high. So I'm gonna check if that actually worked, but as you can see, you can fully customize the thing to your likings. So we just open up the shop again, scroll down a little bit and should hopefully see that the thing is a little less high now. The pictures are all getting centered good and covered in there. And yeah, that pretty much brings us to the end of the video. Hope you guys found that useful. If you did, always feel free to leave a like and a follow. And with that being said, have a good one and peace out.